Well, Ginger Hotels, a subsidiary of Indian Hotels, has recently opened its biggest property of more than 370 rooms in Mumbai. The hotel chain has also said that it will expand its footprint with two similar properties in Goa and Bengaluru. Rachnath and Rajani caught up with Deepika Rao as well as the Suma Venkatesh of Indian Hotels on the group's larger strategy. Take a look. Started in 2004 from the house of IHCL, a brand that has given us hotels like Taj and Vivanta, came Ginger Hotels. And though it was perceived as a business hotel initially, it was in 2018 when it took a turn towards being lean luxury. And now with 371 keys at this newly opened up Ginger near Mumbai International Airport, this one is the biggest of its kind. <laughs> Sports bar, an all day diner, and other such amenities, Ginger Hotels aims to target consumers of all ages and backgrounds. Recently, the project Avhan was launched, which is a three pronged strategy to grow profitably. How is that coming along? Avhan actually we announced uh, last year in May, uh, and it was our guidance to for the period till FY26. Maybe if you look at three parts of that strategy, one was to take our portfolio to 300 hotels and we're actually pacing ahead of that. We're already 285 and there's still another two years to go. So we're quite confident that uh, that particular metric will be met before time. Uh, the second was to maintain a nil debt uh, status and that continues to be the case. Uh, the third aspect of our one was to also look at a 33% EBITDA margin at IHCL Consolidated. So we just announced our uh, quarter results and nine months uh, period we are at a 32.7 percent EBITDA margin. So I would say that uh, we are either pacing ahead or we are on our guidance for our one. Talking about new locations where Taj is going, one of the hottest locations that we all heard about was Lakshadweep. How is that coming about? What's the strategy and any other location you're looking at? So Lakshadweep is a hot, hot uh, destination today. It's like the uh, the new Maldives of India, if I may say that. Uh, so for us, Lakshadweep is a great crown, uh, a jewel in our crown. And this will be a fantastic uh, hotel, a luxury hotel that will create on two of the islands in Lakshadweep, the Suheli and Kadmat. And this will be the first eco-sensitive resort because we want to, while we want to uh, explore the destination, you don't want to leave a huge footprint on the uh, very fragile island.